I always knew I wanted to adopt. When we were pregnant with our third child, we went to a fostering informational meeting. There was such a need in Arizona that we knew it was something we had to help with. I always say our hearts are big enough, our home is big enough, our car is big enough. I just felt God was leading us to that. We then started looking into getting our license and growing our family through foster adopt. I called our licensing worker, told her to put us on the open beds list. She called me back and said, I got in touch with a case manager. There's a little baby girl who's about three months old and ready for a home. And they're wondering if you could come get her. So we're driving home, looking at her and just adoring her. And my husband looks over at the paperwork and he said, it says she has a twin sister. And so I just start praying, Lord, what are we going to do about this twin? Like, we cannot take in two babies. We cannot do this. I'm just bawling. My husband wakes up and goes, what's wrong? What's going on? And I said, I just can't stop thinking about our sister. We, we have to keep them together. And my husband said, okay, I'll support you in this and I'll do this with you. I say that's when the fun began. <laughs> Christian Family Care was so supportive through the whole process. They would come and they would pray over our family once a month. Because of amazing organizations and through God and through family that comes alongside you, it makes it easier and it makes it doable. And we couldn't do it without these organizations in our community. It just helps take some burden out of it and some worry and um, just helps guide you in the right direction to be able to then just focus on loving and taking care of these kids. When we were surprised with twins, we only had one crib. My licensing worker from Christian Family Care recommended a place called Arizona Helping Hands. They said that they would be happy to provide two cribs and two crib mattresses for us. So the girls had a safe place to sleep and no matter where they might go next, they had their beds that would go with them and their safe place. Arizona Helping Hands is the largest provider of basic needs to children in the state of Arizona in their foster care system. Today in the state of Arizona, there's 16,000 children in foster care. We provide those basic items, something as simple as a bed, to clothing, diapers, personal care packages, birthday packages, holiday toys. We're doing everything we can to try and help these kids feel a little bit more normal, help kids move into a, a situation where they're safe, secure, and happy. You can help in a very direct way if you provide a child with a bed to sleep on. Arizona Helping Hands stepped in and started filling that need throughout the state. We are the largest provider of such services to kids throughout the state. In 2018, we will provide 3,200 children with a bed to sleep on. Arizona Helping Hands wants to say thanks to everybody who's attending the Winter Wonder Program. These dollars contributed will help us buy beds and cribs to help children in foster care. It is so important for our community to come together to encircle these kids with love and to make a difference in their lives.